to my channel. I am so super excited. So after about the third or fourth Dollar Tree, I went in and lo and behold, they are taking out Halloween and fall decorations. So I was super, super happy. So finally, I can do some more of my craft uh, fair items with items that I purchased from the Dollar Tree. Now I know that Hobby Lobby had it all. However, instead of paying $4.99 to $6.99 for a roll of ribbon, I pay a dollar. So I'm going to get started on what I picked up yesterday at the Dollar Tree. Um, first thing, I pick these up almost every year. They're um, the leaves on a stem. These are the maple leaf and they have like a shimmer to it. Um, just like using those in my fall decorating or my craft, my craft, my craft, my craft um, items. So I picked these up. I think I picked up two of those yesterday, which I was super happy. There was not a lot of stuff out, but enough for me to be able to pick what I needed. So I was kind of happy. Now this I thought was how stinking cute are these. You get three count of these cute little containers. It has little pumpkins all over it. Cute. So I picked these two of these up. Um, Either I'm going to use this in my craft bazaar to display some items or they're going to be part of something I do for the bazaar like um, I don't know if I'm going to do a basket of goodies and wrap it up for, for that or whatever but I just thought they were cute. I picked them up and even during Halloween instead of doing a pumpkin for my family I might just do a basket of of stuff so we'll see. Um, then I picked up for school for um, it's just a, an emoji, uh, antibacterial aim wipes. They come in a cute little container and they attach their backpack. So I picked this up yesterday. It was in front of the counter, you know, that last minute buy that they make sure that you get. Well, I was one of their customers. <laughs> then I picked up some more maple leaf. These do not have a stem to them, um, but you can um, scatter them on the table or, I mean, you can actually glue these to something. So I picked up two, that means I should have a hundred um, maple leaves. What I also like to do sometimes is do um, a little garland with raffia and you glue the um, leaves to the raffia. So if I have time to create that, I will. And I'll show you how I usually did that. And it usually didn't last so long because then you have to put it away and sometimes the raffia and the leaves get a little bent and stuff. So then they had some washi tape yesterday and I just picked them up. One is an umbrella with rain, April showers, I guess, and the other one I liked it because it has that aqua blue, which is one of my favorite colors. So I picked those up yesterday. And, um, can we say ribbon? Oh my gosh. My only thing, though, they had four containers. I think there's five per container. They only had three or four. So hopefully they'll get more than that because, tell you what, it was pretty picked over already and I was kind of surprised. So I'm going to pick out the ones that I have more than one here. So what I decided to do is I picked up three of the polka dot orange and black. Um, this is mainly going to be for decoration for um, Halloween. Um, it's going to make a nice bow and I'm going to need three bows. And when I do decorate, I will tell you what I'm, I'll show you what I did with these. Um, super cute. I just like it. Really looks Halloweeny to me. So I like that. And then it could be used for uh, fall or Halloween, I think still, is the uh, earring bone design of uh, black and orange. It feels almost, it, it, um, it's stiff. It's like a burlap. There we go. And I really liked it. And you get quite a bit on here. You get nine foot for, of ribbon, like a really, I'm telling you guys, it's wire, it's strong, it's really nice, and I can't wait to do my project with this. Um, so stay tuned for that. So if you want to follow along in the project or you just want to make it right after you watch the video, I will both get yourself some of this or some ribbon kind of like this that will be strong. And I picked up eight of these. I want to make sure I had enough. And then I just picked up some regular uh, glitter, um, orange and glitter black ribbon. Not quite sure where I'm going to use these, but I always find a place for stuff. Uh, and I picked up a couple. I think I did two orange and one black. So I kind of like that. So I picked up that ribbon yesterday. This is all ribbon. So, yes. 
Then I seen a lot of you pick this up and I was like, please, 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 let's have it. I absolutely love this. This is giving me the idea of actually printing these uh, or doing the kind of same thing on some wood. I just think that is cool. I think even if you would cut it and attach this part to like a piece of wood, how cool would that be? So um, I'm not sure yet, um, but that's might be something that I'm going to do. Uh, Arvis give thanks, falling leaves, autumn gathering, gatherings, happy fall y'all, and pumpkin patch. I just thought these, this was absolutely cute for a dollar. So, and it's um, not that cardboard like they had last year. Some of mine fell apart, but this is a pretty strong, um, um, whatever that's called, fake, whatever it is. Then I really want to do this one project um, on a wreath. So, cheese. So they picked, they, um, they had these uh, yesterday. I guess, you know, it's fall time and you want to make some wreaths. I think at Hobby Lobby or in, in Michael's, they sell these over $3. I've seen them. Um, it's a wire metal wreath. And so what I'm going to do a project with these, and you will see, I picked up more because I will be selling them at my bazaar, at the craft bazaar, not mine, but the bazaar. And so if you see these, you might want to pick them up because I think you can do so much with this. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and show you a little idea that I have. So you take your ribbon and you stick it through and you tie a, a little knot and then you just let your ribbon um, more like this. Take your ribbon, make a loop, and loop it through, and do like tie wreath. You can do that with this, or you can do other things with it. Um, you can use um, ta -da, these little Chanel stems and attach your ribbon to this with some burlap. Anyways, I have a lot of ideas in my head on how I want to do this, so that is why I picked up these yes these yesterday at. Um, the Dollar Tree because you can't be there. I think I have eight, two, four, excuse me, nine. I always do that. I always pick one over. So anyway, then I bought some fall colors, chenille stem. Um, the purple is Halloween looking. So picked that up yesterday. I just wish I would have picked up more of those, but I didn't. So we'll, we'll stay with that. And the other things that I picked up yesterday, which this was gone. What you see in my hands, one more. This is all they had yesterday. The rest of it was gone. So this will be part of that wreath that I'm thinking about making too. Um, this, and of course I don't have my glasses on my head. Um, it's mesh, decorating mesh, and a yellow with some, a little bit of tread of gold. And then this one is orange with a little tint of gold tread. So pick these up. Like I said, if you go to your Dollar Tree right now, I don't know if it's the craze of whatever it is, kids are driving parents crazy and they just won't fall here. They're picking it up a lot of these uh, fall items, so it was pretty empty already and I'm like, I hopefully they'll restock. So, anyways, up uh, here's another one of these. I picked up three of these leaves yesterday. Then I thought, how cute are these? Well, picked up one more so I had there was five two orange and three yellow okay then they had these which I think they're so cute these little decorative acorns you get a pack of 12 and um, I just picked up 12 but I think I might go ahead and go and pick up some more because I want to kind of do um, a little jar with them or um, put them in a wreath or something but I just thought these were cute I picked them up yesterday and the other thing I picked up were these little gold, um, they're, they're, they look gold but they're not, they, um, what color would that be? <sighs> Anyways, I, you get five little pumpkins in a bag for a dollar, which is really good buy. Um, I saw the ceramic ones, but I'm really looking for the metallic colors. We didn't have those at our Dollar Tree yesterday, well, the one Dollar Tree, which is about 30 minutes for me to go to. I just passed by there and I thought I'm going to stop here too and see. But um, 
lots of things coming out. I am sure that was not the end of their fall and uh, Halloween stuff. So when I go back, I will try to see what else I can come out with at the Dollar Tree. But for right now, I'm quite happy with what I have. Um, like I said, if you go to Dollar Tree, it's there. Pick it up because it might be gone, especially seasonal items like the fall items. But don't forget, you can always go to DollarTree.com and order boxes and have it shipped. Just remember, you get a lot. You get. 24 I think for a box or whatever but if you're a crafter and you do a lot of projects that might be a good way to go that way you are guaranteeing yourself the product so just wanted to say that so that is my haul for the Dollar Tree just imagine my squeal when I walk in yesterday get a few looks but that's okay because um, I was really excited about them having um, fall items already so that was cool because some of you have beaten me by two weeks here so I can't wait to do my craft projects for you to watch um, my videos of Craft Bazaar, my series that I'm doing now. So I really appreciate all of you new subscribers to my channel. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope that I'm inspiring you to create new things for your home, especially with the seasons of uh, fall, Halloween, and Christmas coming, and Thanksgiving. Cannot forget Thanksgiving. So thanks for watching. Remember, I bring things home, I bring it with love, and I bring it to life. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and have a great day. Thank you.